Okay, who's ready for some crime? And you know how we should celebrate afterwards. Karaoke! Yes! So, Nina, are we taking your project car? Fuck no, I'm not risking my baby over rent. We're boosting cars from down the street. Just take that yellow one. Kev, you case the place. Someone's yeah. Changes, but life throws your way. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. But to realize that power, there's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss of your job, of your happiness, of your life. You don't make $15 an hour, no. You're selling hours of your life away for 15 bucks a piece. So what do I say to the person who wants to get paid what they deserve? That's right, be your own boss. One of these days, I'm gonna get you to listen to music in the car. Roger McGillicuddy speaks the music of my soul. You are a different kind of cat, Eli. Time to beat it before the cops show up. Life is full of adversity and challenges. But- Oh, fuck no. I'm monitoring the police scanner. They're just responding to the call. Cops are now en route to the payday place. Sounds like they're out in force. Crap. Bad time for a train. car now. It was safe and sound at the junkyard a minute ago. That's pretty deep in Pantero's territory. Did you tell your gang you did that? Are you kidding me? If Sergio knew we were running a job on his turf, he would have taken a 90% cut. 90%? Good God. The man's either a monster or a capitalist genius.
What? what the fuck did you assholes do to my getaway car? Ain't your car if it's on our turf. Now you're gonna pay for parking. We're taking you down! I don't have time for this shit today. You can't fight back against <laughs> us! <laughs> Things I do to pay my rent. Ah. Ah. Pantero scrapped my switch car. They what? Bigger problem. The police picked up that firefight at the junkyard. They're heading your way. Grab a bike and head off-road. I'll pick you up in the desert. Damn. Sounds like no karaoke tonight. Every fucking time, man. Overdrive. Come <laughs> on. 
<sighs> well, shit. Freeze! Down on the ground! You said you didn't want to risk your car. I said I didn't want to risk it for rent. I'd risk anything for you, dummies. So, is this how it's gonna be every time we have to pay rent? I thought that went great. Yeah, okay. Hey, glad you made it home safe. We have to get better at this rent thing or we'll never get to do karaoke again. Also, we'll get evicted. Nina said you might go back to some of your old side hustles. I have some friends who might need work done in your area of expertise. I'll put their info on your map. I think you'll really like them. All I can find as long as their money's good. Thanks, Cap. Newbie, I've assigned you a driver for your next job. Meet us at the rendezvous. I'll be right there.
is everyone? I didn't need everyone. Just you. Because I'm the only one who could get it done. Sure, let's go with that. Sergio, huh? You're familiar with Panteros? I mean, my roommate's one of them, so yeah. I don't give me that look. Rent's expensive. Is this gonna be a problem? I mean, per the roommate code, I'm gonna have to fold her laundry for two weeks, but beyond that, I'm golden. What are they moving? Antiquities, mostly. The Nawali was waiting to sync up with them before he was captured. You mean before we captured him? I'm pretty sure you were about to die when I came along and saved your ass. And yet, if I hadn't stalled him, he would have got away. So, you're welcome. Do you want it to look like an accident or a statement? What? Well, I'm assuming you want me to make the convoy disappear? No, I want you to follow it. So I can kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. So we know where they're going. Sure, and then I kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. No. Then you will report back to me, I will arrive with the team, and you will go home and hit the showers before you have a chance to fuck it up. Hey there. My name's JR. We about to see some action? Nope. Orders are to follow the convoy, observe its activity, and report back. Seriously? The convoy's right there. You know, I heard about you. I'm a little bit of a maverick myself. Two crazy badasses like us, we're not gonna mix it up? No, my friends are counting on me to get my performance bonus. I can't afford to screw it up. Don't engage, just observe and report. Looks like them motorcycles are falling back. Probably just dropped something. Time for another workout. Excuse you me? You gonna just let them shoot at us? Gwen was very clear on not engaging. We don't do something? All we're gonna observe and report is getting dead. <sighs> Fine. Just this once. <laughs> That's how I like to ride. On track. From here on out, serve and report. Ah, oh, fuck. They have a turret. Can't take this kind of fire forever. Our orders are to follow that. No can do. Unless you want to take that thing out. I. Ah, God damn it. Get in closer. Wait. What are you doing? Taking out the turret. From the roof? No, from the truck. Get me closer. You're out of your goddamn mind. I thought you said you were a maverick. A little bit. I said a little bit. Go. Oh. Uh. Might leave this out of the report. Heads up. You got more incoming. Oh, come on. I was almost done. Ah, as long as I'm here. Toby? Why am I seeing gunfire at the back of that convoy? When? Well, there were motorcycles and, and a turret, and one thing led to another. Well, that was quick. You don't sound mad. Did you honestly think I would send one car after a convoy that size? You're just a distraction. We got a drone following these motherfuckers. Wait, you used me as bait. That's the job you were born for. Mission accomplished. Now finish what you're doing and get out of there. That turret had given them a taste of their own medicine. Fuck. Don't waste bullets on them armored cars. Panteros build them tough. JR, pick me up. I can't get close. That truck's on fire. Shit. Gotta get off that truck without me. Fuck, the car's on fire.
bad move. Ah, oh, this one's burning too! I thought I ordered you to retreat. Honest to God, I am trying. Well, as distractions go, you're exceeding expectations. Great. Can you put that in my performance review? My performance bonus over this. Over here, jump. Finally, let's follow orders and fall back. Us. Shoot him! Shoot him! You think you can take my shit? He's coming again! Push him back! Nobody steals from Sergio! He's rolling up my six! Heck off, asshole! See your way out. Keep your head down. It's gonna be tight. Shit! Huh. You think that guy's compensating for something? Don't count him out. It'll take more than a car wreck to kill that some bitch. Okay, time to finally get the fuck out of what is that? Sandstorm! We're going in! Come in, newbie! When? We hear you. We're falling back. Negative! The drone is down. I need. Need eyes on that convoy. I'm giving you field command. Fuck, really? Do what you gotta do. Follow the lead truck until it stops, then radio. JR, let's get him. Kid gloves are off. The kid gloves were on? Oh. Ouch. <laughs> if I can't see them, they can't see me, right? <laughs> See the main convoy ahead. Uh, we got a problem here. Be more specific. Sand's clogging up my intake. We're losing speed. Great. Just get me into jumping range, then fall back. That's suicide. I got us this far, didn't I? I don't want to be a maverick no more. Shit, turrets! Oh. You did not just do that. We're taking you down! Are those turrets connected by a hitch? 
Drive me to that flatbed or I will shoot you in the fucking face! Shitbags! Where's my rear guard? Still following, just from very close. Get this asshole off my rig! Let's see a drone do this! When said to do what I need. I got this. End of the line, motherfucker. You jumped in the wrong cab. Bad move. Oh, do not test me. Okay. We're taking you down. The longer I wait, the worse I fuck you up. You won't leave this desert alive. Ow! That hurt. Oh. Let's see who's stronger. End of the line, motherfucker. You fuck with Sergio's business. You think you can walk away from that? Now it's my turn. Ooh. End of the line, motherfucker. You're dead, mierda. I'm fucking mad now. I did to your truck.
Hey, Gwen. I followed the convoy. It, uh... It stopped. You did good. Holy shit, a compliment. Yeah, yeah. Stay here. Newbie, get over here. Now! Gwen says you were responsible for retrieving the Hummingbird Codex. If that was something in the truck, then yes. Impressive work. I wouldn't have been able to do it without JR, sir. Team player. I like that. There's someone I'd like you to meet. This is Dr. Antonio Espina. He's the chief curator for the Museum of Santo Aliso. It's nice to meet you, sir. The retrieval of these relics is no small feat. The museum is in Marshall's debt. Just doing my job, sir. Antonio's museum has a contract with Marshall, and he requested you to be in charge of security. What? Gwen's filled me in on your... Thank <laughs> you. 